All right, today, guys, we were at our local music ground today picking up a shotgun mic, which is off that way at a shot. So we'll see how this works. I've got two shotgun mics here. I've got one on my camera that I always use, and I got this new one, which is a Rode. NTG4 plus, something like that. Anyways, it's a road condenser mic, shotgun mic. Anyways, the cool thing is it's USB, it's USB chargeable, so it's got its own lithium battery that recharges. Not the point of today's video. Today's video is about something new that I found, and I'm looking at them here. Uh, when I was there at Music Go Around in my local, local northern Colorado area, in Fort Collins, and I was talking with the owner, and he picked these up. Um, I'll zoom a little closer. Ta da! I got two packages. They are called No Nuts Symbol Rings and Symbol Sleeves. So I've got the sleeves here and then I've got the rings here. So I figured we'd do a little bit of an opening with these and kind of go over them and then maybe go over to our drum kit over in the live room and kind of show how they work there. So this is going to be kind of interesting. So I'm going to open up. We'll start with the rings. So I'm going to open up the rings here. Um, packaging is just, it's a baggy stapled with some paper. Not super fancy. Kind of sustainable if you really think about it. So we'll throw those down on the ground. Um, I'm going to try to get, see if the guys from No Nuts you know, can watch this video. So I'm going to pull these out. These, throw the plastic over there. These are just a rubber... It's just a piece of rubber, really. There's nothing fancy about it. It's a rubber ring. Let me get a little closer. Rubber ring. Um, that's it. There's six of them in this bag here. I think they had another bag that had maybe more at the shop, but um, they smell like rubber. They smell weird. Anyways, um, that's it. They're just it, there's six of them here. I got three and three. So, anyways, so that's those. Now let's go over. The sleeves and the sleeves are packaged the same. It says they're extremely durable. They're extra long. Um, so the thing about the sleeves is this is so you don't have to uh, deal with wing nuts on the top of your cymbal stands. And I'm going to bring one of the cymbal stands I think just over here rather than going over the drum kit. So, anyways, I'll pull it out here. I'm just going to pull out one because they're all the same. Should have done that with the other ones, but I didn't. Put that there, and that's it. They look. You know, it looks like they might have some threading in there. So they might thread on the symbol stand. We'll see here in a moment. But anyways, um, yeah, just plastic it looks like. Nothing super fancy. They are made in the United States. Awesome guys at No Nuts. Way to make stuff in our own country. Um, so let's go get a symbol stand. Be right back. We're back with symbol stands. We got... Back up. Back up. So we're back here. We've got our cymbal stand. We've got I'm gonna get a couple of these little rings over here. So we got our cymbal stand. Um, I'm gonna unscrew it here. So this is your kind of traditional. These are cheaper stands. They're Tama stands, I think. Um, you got your felt, Zildjian A. You know, you got your other bottom fell, and then you got the guy that, and I don't know if I can take this off of here. We may not be able to do that with this particular stand. I thought maybe, it, there we go, Never mind. I was wrong. So anyways, stand all, this stand is all taken apart now. We've got just the bare metal, got all the original hardware taken off. It's all taken off, don't have to use it. So we're gonna put, this guy just right on there and it feels like it kind of just kind of just screws on that might be it for this so we can get to going a little further it might not work with this particular stand that i got or it might just be that they're brand new and they're a little stiff Anyways, we got them on there. So the theory is that you can take your symbol and just sit it right there and it just stays. And then when you're done, you just pull it off. So, kind of like it. And I guess we want to keep it on there. We could maybe, there we go. 
So these are designed, these rubber guys are designed to do cymbal stacks. I'm gonna put one on the bottom just to kind of see what that does. And then I'm gonna put another one on top just to kind of keep it from, from moving. And there we go. I don't have a stick to hit it with, but that's it. You know, kind of flubs, flops around. I don't know. I think I'll take the rubbers off of them. Uh -huh, rubbers. Um, so we can get these off of here. Not meant, I don't think it's meant to go down quite that far. Ah, but you can use the rubber uh, rings here as a symbol. Um, what do you call it? Basically, um, I'm trying to see if I can take this back apart here. So as I'm talking here, you know, you can use the rubber uh, rings to do cymbal stacks, as they were showing me at the store. And I thought that was kind of a cool option. And I think that's all that's gonna do. So that's kind of stuck on there, I think, for now. So, as you can tell, it just <laughs> stays on there. And if I'm done, when I'm done, I go, the next person brings their cymbals in. We just sit them on there and away we go, you know. Um, I think it's better, it, from what I can feel, compared, I'm going to pull I Hopefully I bought enough of these. Well, I hope I did. Anyways, from what I can feel here, as I get the symbol out of the way, is that this is the hard plastic that comes with kind of your generic symbol stand. And then you put the foam, you know, you kind of put the felt on there to keep it from destroying your symbol or you know you're not even necessarily destroying the symbol just kind of keeping actually you can already see where this one's starting to wear through because on plastic you'll get this the symbol eventually from just moving around and flopping it'll cut through this plastic and then it's rubbing metal on metal and then you're like oh, crap what am i going to do now you know i suppose you could put your i suppose you could put felts on these if you wanted Felt does fit, they fit through a felt. So if you wanted to put the original felt back on. Um, but from what I'm also told with the rubber, not only can these rubber pieces, you know, do symbol stacks, like I could put another symbol, put it on there, put another symbol on top of it and make cool symbol stacks. But you can also use them to replace like the felt. And I'm gonna try this with the hi-hat later, later today maybe. Um, you can put them on there and you can replace the felts in your clutch on your Symbols. Um, I guess our local music ground got these when they were at NAMM this year, which are super cool. Um, I'm really excited to continue trying them out with different symbols and stuff. But that's today's video. Um, if you enjoyed it, hit the like and subscribe. Uh, hit the bell to get more notifications. And those who have hit subscribe and you know like like our channel, awesome. Thank you. Um, share it with your friends if you find them entertaining or these are informational for you too. And our guys at Fort Collins Music Ground, thank you very much for showing us these and we did buy them, just not sponsored. So we did buy these and honestly, I'll probably buy more. Um, so easy to put on, so easy to install. So thanks for watching. We'll see you next time and go make some music and other things. So see you later.